All right, lads and lasses, not modest pelican here. We are going to be doing a. We're gonna be playing episode two of uh, the Walking Dead Telltale. I don't know why the fuck I was blanking out on the name. I guess I'm just Previously, dumb as hell for dead. today. We have some I know angry who you customers are. right there. Oh, I got another good one for you. Drunk driver as well. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're Hello? our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. Fucking bitch. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitch. That motherfucker, we Uncle Ruck. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> God. I'm hungry. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Larry's his uncle, Ruckus. He's he's a hater, but he hates on everyone, not just black people. Nah, if Larry was alive till the last season, he would have been a hater on Clem. Who the fuck does Larry like? <laughs> oh yeah, if you guys, if you guys think I'm schizophrenic or anything, it's just that like I'm talking to my sister in the background. I'm not like schizophrenic or some shit. Oh yeah, Axolotl Boba. Damn. I find her name you need because Boba uh, can like a mean rabbit. like stupid in Spanish. Uh, well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so, so yeah. much at the time. Emma's my favorite Maybe Boba you shouldn't sister. have opened the door. Yeah, except like then I'd probably Boba? be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark. Yeah, I'm up with it. I can clip that. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I, I remember, so I wouldn't Carly's get in trouble when we were night. younger. I thought she was gonna take off my hand. Bola. I would call her Boba Fett all from, the <laughs> from Star Wars just, just to slack. get around it. Because like that pair, I'd be a, if yeah, I would snitch right. on me, I would say, I wish I knew for nah, sure that's how much a Star Wars character. <laughs> and I'd get away with it, like a little fucking snitch. Oh wait, I didn't even pay we'll attention to what I said. Maybe. We'll manage. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. But he knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Wait, I'm fighting just thinking, the what the fuck is Lee supposed getting to pretty hunt with tense back at the motor end. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Why the fuck would a rabbit go close to his leg? You know what? Explain yourself. My sister's gonna explain herself. I don't Kenny know, because if the, if the rabbit man. is like mm, close to his we'll leg, see. he's got some can't good blame him, distance. Though. You can't you exactly Larry shoot going with a gun that has night? like a scope to we'll the see guy's deal anyway. Seems like he's Why got the a fuck would you swing, swing an axe at your own leg? Let me stupid to do that. Yeah, that shut you up real quick. You know what, watch this. He's just an old racist asshole. <laughs> That's his deal. <laughs> Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Hard problems or not, we should all be out here trying to find food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. He also knocked Kenny's ass flat on the floor. Bro got a slump like a pancake. Nah, all that noise for that little ass don't. bird. Don't worry about it. bring walkers. One bird's not worth it. <sighs> yeah, I know. I'm just really freaking hungry. Aren't those like the birds from Shit, Disneyland? was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Ah! 
Jesus Christ. Oh. oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? I don't know, man. Lee, this is fucked up. You gotta help. Please. Then shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. This isn't our problem. We should go. No, no, please. At least just look at the trap. Just look at it, and maybe you can tell us how to get it off. Please help me. Hurry, please, hurry. This trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Uh, yeah. See? Oh no. Shit! Walkers! It's now or never, Lee! Please! Get me out of this! Mark, get the boys back! Danny, I'm keep those I walkers off of me! Fuck off. <laughs> really you think you, you can get it open? Please. please hurry! Get please. me Do out of something. this! Do something! This is really bad. <laughs> Just get me out, please! So bad. My blood is screaming! Shit. We're gonna be surrounded any minute! Try to get the chain! Come on, do something! Oh, swing it. Oh, God, hurry! Let's go, let's go! Why would somebody do this? Oh, Jesus, those things are gonna be here soon! Forget it! We use chain like that Air Force Base to lift order. Why is this not cutting to us? It has to be now! He's lost so much blood already! Uh, please, please hurry up! Yeah. Uh, yeah, well, There's so much blood! <laughs> Not Damn it, Lee just cut off his There's fucking leg! There's gotta be another one! Oh, we don't have time for that! I'm I sorry! Know. We have to go! Stop, now! Stop! Stop! Please! We can't just leave him like this! Is it possible for this person to get him? Stop! 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 Lee! I can't keep him back! Fuck! I'm just wasting an ammo now! We gotta go! to get him out! You have to! Fuck, do you get these things open? We don't know! Oh god, there's so many of them! It's impossible! It locks or something! Hurry! Is Jesus! He, is I he gonna make to it? Walk. Is it possible for me to do nothing? I don't wanna do nothing. This can't be happening. Stop, stop, stop! There's gotta be please, something please, we can please. do! Oh, it's not here. Oh, here. There has to be a way out of this! Stop, stop, stop! Yeah. I Come on, do, wait, we gotta oh. go, now! No! <laughs> no, don't leave me! Damn it, Lee! I'm sorry. No! We can't leave Mr. Parker like that! Give me the gun! Uh, Give it to me! Like Travis! Like Travis. Yeah, it. You go! <laughs> Can we take the kids? Oh, I think we take the kids now. Shit! What happened? Somehow we have to find out the walkers are... Just say fuck off. Oh god. Grab the kid, keep moving! Oh yeah, you take the kid, I just take the kid. Come on! Move! You can't leave me like this. Please get me out. Killed him. Him. Oh. Fucking Larry going at a little wrong. What's, what's he doing? If anything, he's weakening the board. <laughs> Wait, that's... That looks that looks so miserable. I mean, does that at least fucking drawing? I'm just taking a ball, look on this or that shit. He's like that meme of that like fucking ant with like a <laughs> little bag. Why does Lily look happy? Should it be happy?
Wait, why would we take the rifle with the scope on it? Would it be better to give Lily that one? <laughs> the fuck's Larry gonna do? <laughs> you gonna like throw the rock that he was holding? Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's going on? have time to explain. Me, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What? No, Show I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good out. idea. Jesus Christ. We left the other one behind. Other one? Jesus, Lee. What if there are more of them? What if they followed you here? There wasn't anybody else, just us! How do you know he's not lying? Well, hang on. We you haven't even talked to out. these people yet. Maybe they can like be helpful. Come on, Lily, point. these are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... The Just come on, okay? You, know, you like Sounds to like think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power I struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey. I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the wall. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? No, I'm gonna just be a dick. You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. <laughs> That's me at work, for real. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to not have enough food for everyone. Who decided to just give half a fucking apple? Like, what a dickhead. <laughs> Who ate the other half? Like, that shit would have gotten rotten. But why? Just, like, give him the whole fucking apple. But that apple would be rotten in, like, a couple hours. <laughs> ben, where the fuck are you looking at? You're new to the group. You're not eating shit. Eat the fucking crayons that like Clem's drawing. I don't know who the fuck I'm feeding. Can I eat that shit myself? You know, be a fat fuck. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I I didn't realize I was getting this. You just like my dad for real. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got sixty cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up, quit being such a pansy. I kind of want to fucking feed Mark. Or should I put, should I fucking feed Larry just for the hell of it? I don't know. Nah, she can starve. How are you doing? Yeah, Clem's gonna starve. Okay. Yo, where's your hat? Where's your hat? Yo, I don't know. Hat. Can you help me find it? Sure. Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. Would say no I promise. Hat, if I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. 
I've got to take care of something. Why don't you go take back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Where is she gonna wash her hair? They said they have working water. No, they it don't. At the yeah. beginning of the apocalypse. Wait, Kenny. Nah, I have to, I have to feed the kids first. Clementine. Here, Clem. Get an apple. You need something to eat. Here, you can have an apple. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um. Enjoy it. You deserve it. Three pieces of food. Hey, Doc. Doc, how about a little dollar. food? Here. You get fucking crackers. Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! Can I feed my wife? Your wife? She's my wife now. Oh, wait, no, no, not Kenny, not Kenny. That was a misclick. That was a misclick. Want something to eat? She looks like a she looks like a cheese and crackers Here. kind of person. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but. You don't owe me anything, Carly. She didn't want the food. Okay. Uh, guess I'll give it to Kenny then. <laughs> Kenny's getting food. But actually, should I give some to Lily? Should be a dick sucker. Cause I already fed Kenny. Also, Mark kind of went hunting. He kind of deserves this shit. He's weak. He can't even hold up a, Here, a board. Here, eat something. Oh, look how fucking skinny he is. We need to fatten him up. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Should I give it to? You know what? Let's really love rubbing in the Larry. I gave him food. Here, Mark, this is Ax too. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and that's what you think this is? <laughs> is that what you told him? Yeah, that's right. And what are you going to do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, more like but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So Wait, I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Why the fuck would I give it to Ben? He, he hasn't done shit. One piece of food left. Uh, some Someone of these else. people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Give it to Katja. <laughs> Kenny would be Kenny would be proud if I gave Here, it to his wife. Eat something. <sighs> Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just Very apply good. some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. What were you thinking bringing him here? Even if he lives, we aren't going to be able to take care of him. It's what your husband wanted. <sighs> Figures. I love that man to death, but I swear sometimes he's dumber than a bag of hammers. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay, so she don't want food either.
Nah, I, th I already tried to give it to Let's give it to Lily. Because I already sided with Kenny earlier. Actually. Fuck Lily. Actually. Let's give it to Kenny. Fuck it. He's the homie. I think he'll enjoy some Want something crackers. to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Not such an easy job, is it? Never said it was. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Yeah, of course. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What I'm happened to my food? Fun. There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Of course that racist motherfucker wants to build a wall. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... I'm sick of this shit, too. You don't think I am? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's for the best. We're already struggling to feed our own kids. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? What the fuck yeah. would a dog done? Thanks. <laughs> he fucking whistled at Why'd you something? bring him here Whacked in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. God help us. It makes sense. We need the Lord. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides. Everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! What the f brother? Uh, yo, Whoa, who's lady, who's relax! Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Harley. Are you armed? Yeah. F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But, uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Never trust Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. 
Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Nah, his name is Andrew, not Andy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit? I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Wait, we need to say no? What happens if we say no? I think yeah. we'll stay here. We're starting to develop a good vibe here at the motel. Good vibe? Well, Christ, daddy -o. I'm sorry the folks with the food supply and defenses didn't tickle your pretty pink ass. <laughs> we need to think like a group, Lee. This affects everyone. Then we vote. If everyone agrees, then we'll send you guys with some gas to check the place out. And if we don't? Then we'll stay in this wretched roach motel with your recreational paperweight over there. Plus, we stay close to Macon where we have access to the pharmacy for dad. Penny, Katja? We go. Dad? You bet you, Pumpkin. Harley? I said we go. So I'm in. If they're offering food, we gotta at least check it out. Clementine, what do you think? We... I'm very hungry. All right. Looks like we're going to a dairy. Honestly, this so this, this dairy. Like the much you guys really have food? Sure say, do. Yeah, fuck it, we lost out. most of the cattle, but we still like, have lots of milk, been butter, and cheese thing in the first place. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Larry had every right to be pissed at me there. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. That wasn't me when I got, well, first got promoted. Think so so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. He was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up Probably the goat. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? If I was... If I was Lee, I would straight up... I would straight up murder a zombie that has a wedding ring and then propose to her. That's the most romantic shit you could do in the apocalypse. I, have to I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? Who's, who's running things? Who should I say? <laughs> I should say it's a democracy. I mean, we literally just we voted. as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Mm. Well, the kid here is our newest arrival, but we're all looking forward to some food. We really need it. Well, here's to helping each other out. Well, we'd love Never to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... Getting... You think you're going to cut me out of this? Down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people Calm who raided down. my camp. Who oh, are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fuck you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it all to yourselves. Oh no, there's Yeah, and you know what? Over. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? 
Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out. Hope they move on. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Get to the dairy where it's safe. Oh damn, I just remember I was supposed to make a thumbnail for this video. Don't expect something crazy, it's just gonna be a copy and paste of my last thumbnail. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yeah, I think 3,000 is a pretty big number, Carly. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that real offer question. apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come, for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back Southern with the food cool. and round up everyone for the trip over here? Really I'd want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Mark, Lee, why don't you take Wait, a look around? Doug, Once you get Doug settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, Damn, right. they think it's safe, but is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big Bro's deal. Fucking Maybe there's a broken nitpicking. A broken swing? That we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at That's their defenses. a broken swing. Why right. the fuck I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Like walking into a fucking... That's like walking into someone's room. And then be like, oh... There's a like there's like a fucking knife on the bed and going ah oh, I don't like that I don't like that I don't like I don't like that gaming collection you have in the background. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. 
Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How did break? How did break? Yeah, Got busted question. the first day those things showed up. Thank God no one was on it at the time. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Pulling our weight by fixing a fucking sling? That was such an interesting word choice. Meager. Could be useful if I can find some boards to cut. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. <laughs> You know what? Actually, after I might complete the Walking Dead series, I might finish a bunch of other Telltale games. I don't know, maybe like Digby Wolf. They're gonna make like a. Yeah, the one that's Digby Wolf. Yeah. Or what? Are, what other Telltale games? Oh, there's also the shitty Minecraft one. I don't think Life is Strange is Telltale. The board is good, but I need some rope. I need some- oh, I need to find rope. Uh, fuck, is there a quiet kid here? He might know where to find it. What? Was that junk? Is that junk too far? <laughs> My sister said that joke is too far and I can't make it. Where the fuck is this rope, bro? I can't find it. Man, do you have any fucking rope? Hi. Hi. Hey. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? That's a random question to have to ask. Yeah. <laughs> if anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Well, protecting your people is important, but... In my experience, having that many guns around is when people get dangerous. We That's can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Yeah, should make sense. I'm gonna get to know the place for a minute. Okay, well, we gotta secure the perimeter, the so don't take too long. Down? I can't find this rope. I don't see any rope. Do you see any rope? Where the fuck is Dora to, like, show me where the fucking rope is? I don't see rope. Is it here? Is it past the gate? Mmm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Oh, they have herbs? Fuck yeah. No bland food. Wait, what is this? Oh, is there a rope here? The shoe bucket. I found the rope. This rope is oh, perfect for the swing. I found rope. Wait, did I grab the rope? Nothing else I need in here. I think I grabbed the rope. Oh yeah, I'm stupid. There's the rope. This Wait, dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. He said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after damn. My folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world <laughs> changed. Stopped after now this was place lost. is all we have left <laughs> like, of daddy. That's why we take such good care of it, and why we want to share it with good folks like yourselves. He said all of the above. Bro wanted to build a fucking Eiffel Tower, I guess. Bro wanted the New York World Trade Center. 
What is a dairy? It makes sense he wanted to breed her like a cow. All right, this shouldn't be too tough. Well, I'll be damned. Mama's gonna be thrilled to see that old swing all fixed up. Hopefully our kids will like it too. Did you say something, darling? Oh my goodness. Did you do that? Just trying to help out a bit around here. You know, I used to push Andy and his brother out here on that swing every night when they were kids. Seems like such a long time ago now. Yeah, it does. Oh my god, I've already been streaming for 44 minutes. I've barely done shit in this episode. <laughs> This longer than a Breaking Bad episode. Wait, Hi. yo, a Telltale? Did Telltale even, made a fuck, even make a Breaking Bad game? Even if they Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, w good. Would, you, would there be a Fence will meth stop a walker game? in about three or four seconds, but gets overloaded if we leave the husks out there. Game? You know, Mark and I can clear the fence for ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, would that, would well, that that'd be great. Mess, I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. No, they did consult with actual, like, DEA chemists, apparently, to make the scenes look realistic. Mm -hmm. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't I wait until everyone's out bug. here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions no, weren't high enough. That. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. We'll work it out somehow. Well, hopefully he'll calm down once he's out here. There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Wait, that's exactly what it does. Disgusting. Come on, I'm sure there's still a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? <laughs> they seem to have this place have tied down pretty the well. Other cars for gas. Yeah, like, These folks are just delaying the inevitable. This place is gonna fall apart, just like everywhere else. <sighs> Maybe you're right. There's another one. I see it. Bro was gripping that shit. Uh, <laughs> Luke, Mom, you no never man. get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. I'm hungry too, Mark. Do you think they're gonna be good for it? Dinner for a whole group of people? If they've got as much food as they say, I, I think so. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. 
Good idea. <clears throat> What happens if I fail the button match? I'm curious. <laughs> oh, it just goes back down. I thought it was gonna be like. What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. What the? Get to the gate. Get down! You asshole! Why are there unlimited arrows? We had an agreement. Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea! Fuck! Now what? The defense on that gate is our only way out! The dead we pushed down earlier. We're gonna have to move it. You didn't deliver the goods. Now we're gonna take what's owed. Okay. Get closer. Uh, uh, now, where do you think you you're going? You got a lot of Another one? How many of those things did we push down? You assholes. Yeah, I think this one's gonna be. Are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real I mean, sorry. Oh my I'll lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama? Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my God, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just babe. pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We Why ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhands. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down. 
but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Yeah. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food Both on the way to get there. us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, kids, look what Lee got working for you. A swing. I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Thanks, Lee. You're the best. Yeah. Not gonna lie, Lee's jacket is dripped the fuck out. Bro's got drip. Wait, how the fuck does he not start sweating? That's like a thick ass fur jacket in the middle of the day. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Thanks for fixing it. You're welcome. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Fucking hogging it, like, bro. How are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Been lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find yep. the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? Nah, ain't no way. I don't think so. Oh, Lee? Yeah? I miss my family. I know, Clint. I miss mine, too. Fuck that, I am not gonna say we're safe here. Alright, Clem, that's enough for now. Okay, Mark thanks got for pushing me. Shot. Of course, it's all yours. He's not gonna believe yeah. that bullshit. Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance yeah, for now. No use getting ourselves killed. <laughs> we'll wage war on them. Are you going now? Yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. If you got up to this far in the video, please make sure to leave a comment telling me how you're gonna harass See anything? minimum Not wage yet. workers. No. I know it's around it's here. Well. 
it's got Personally, I harass minimum wage workers by hitting the nail tip option while looking them in the eye. Just kidding. I tell them no. Here. And I make them hit the button. Oh shit. You found you it? You don't need to tip them. They're doing their job. Tips are supposed to be for exceptional service. No, tips are supposed to be for excellent service. You turning around a, a little screen and doing your job is not exceptional service. No. No, I'm not gonna tip some dude for just ringing up food that I had, you to, see anybody? That I had to place, pick up, and do everything. If he just stood at the register, you can get no tip. Looks empty. I know, but like... Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the They're tent. literally just doing their job. Did he like greet me or anything? No. If the motherfucker doesn't even say hi to me, they're not even getting a tip. No, if you have to punch in your order, they don't even take your order, what are you tipping them for? Just existing? You get tipped for just existing and doing the bare minimum. You get tipped if you do Clear. excellent service. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. We got our That's what job. I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. Here's That's part of your job. Part of your job is to keep the restaurant house. clean. You should not be enticed to keep a clean station. Like, personally, where I work, our tips, personally, I don't really see a point why we get tipped like crazy. We're just doing the bare minimum. We're just doing our job serving our food. Yeah, we greet them, but that doesn't mean that they're forced to give us a tip. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days, they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. But as I was saying, yeah, so tips should only be for exceptional service. Or for waiters. They also deserve a tip. So they get paid fuck all. Empty. Thank you, that was very necessary. Oh, we found something. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What I else they got over here? Good. Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. 
You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know I me. Know Steal my shit. Are. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Screw this. Oh, wait, wait, I them guns like you're looking to die. No I need to go looking for I death. It's already found us. Just waiting to get turned into monsters. Some of us already are. Go on. Tell him, boy. <laughs> Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. oh. I, didn't, I don't want to shoot her because I was going to hit that button because I mis misread the button. God damn it! You straight up murdered that woman! Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. <sighs> it's a clean shot though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still. What a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Yeah, at least... Come on. We got the cross. Well, at least I found that you technically didn't have to shoot her. I accidentally discovered a speedrun strat. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't Probably, getting yeah. soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. And screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Well, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. <laughs> What's going on with them? Dunno. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. It's Clamor. Oh, have I actually going to see probably play season three that I don't know. Yeah. I've actually never seen season 3, right? Just like... All oh, oh, this creepy motherfucker right here. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. A girl here. You really like that girl. What's not to like? Uh. 
Just kind of creepy, that's all. Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I have. Bro, fucking my god, he's big as big How do you run this place for just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Poor sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. You guys are pretty out of the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go away for a supper then. It'll be a good one. Fuck the Brenda. Pardon me, Brenda. What on your mind? Not to be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here instead of, you know? <laughs> oh, you want to know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Uh, no, no, I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. I'm lost I want some motherfucking pie. I want, I want some other yeah, Best patient I ever had. My boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two by being tough. I still want to check on him. You have to trust me, I've got sick, my share of wounds, and I know what I'm talking about. He said it was all the spicy side, but it was very good. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Your boy Denny is nuts. No, that's not a very nice thing to say, Lee. He seemed to have enjoyed this woman's death. I'm sure he did. He is sensitive and willing to do whatever it takes to protect this place. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters from the game of fans before too long. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow. So Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then, he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the motor inn, where we at least know what to expect. Like I fucking said before. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. Got a point. The way I see it, we just need to skip to dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. He's just a dick. He's the asshole. Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. So basically he just, a he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. And lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. 
All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Fuck your dad. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. You want to pet the cow? It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa. How she says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Then you said it's called a salt lick. Yeah. But don't lick it, it's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. Here comes the time. Come on. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it! You said you would! Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor then who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, Carly. thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the oh, cow with me? Uh, but you go on ahead. No, I want to pet it. I'd be like that cow, Clem. She's pretty. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Mm, it smells funny in here. Like shit, right, Lee? <laughs> hey. You swear it was okay. <laughs> okay. Like <laughs> shit, right? Like shit, right? You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff. Something metal and sharp. Yeah. Don't be paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Okay. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard the noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something. I'll have this thing off in a second. You can back me up in case the farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smashed the luck. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No! Why would you say that? Well, you're... you know... urban? Oh, <laughs> you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry.
prison. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside it, then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you've got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shut up. I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? We're just, we're just exploring the cow house. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boards to help out. I couldn't do it without it. You just leave, like, my boy got a game. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't you, George, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you can't fix the things of humanity every now and then. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? The sad cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run the farm, you know. Think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. You got a mess operation back there? He's out there like Walter Wayne. Is Larry back to living in uh, Oh no, I literally caught the block. Block. That's good. Well, I achieved my goal of caught block ahead. It's definitely not getting laid.
the license plates? Mom, Dad, Is dinner it time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Danny, come along, honey. Honey, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Can I get to sell beer in a sec? The fuck, why are the kids waiting? Man? Pretending. Do we really have to like? You know, do we have to like really go see every single nail get taken off? Boy, didn't you hear the bell? She <laughs> sounded, ra <laughs> sounded racially motivated the way he said, "Boy." I just came in and found the door open like that. Probably my idea, brother. Hey, was anyone with you just now? No. Not the doc? No, she went in the house. Oh, good. Uh, yeah, good. Wait, he fell for that shit? It's like you lied to him. Bro fell for that? Oh, bless you, wow. angel. Oh, Excuse me, sir, we had to block the back door after Walker got upstairs. Don't worry, that was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down, I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could need a horse. Where's mine? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. She just, she's just called, she's just called me filthy. Just like wash your hands, you nasty. Told her a little lady that bitch bigger than me. Jesus, man. Did you find something? Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yo, yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? Shit. He just had a start. They could use some goddamn manners. 
didn't have to be this way. Walk is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off! You're eating him! That's crazy, the man. Hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. I never thought about that. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. He Gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my folks. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rock till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who are gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your free one, <laughs> Dad, oh, now's not the time. The art boy is very much in. You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -hmm. Oh, bad up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Feels like we get stuck in the fridge that way. I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, <laughs> Easy! Dad? Gross love. No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh god, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! He's dead. He's but... not dead! You know what has to happen to me. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! More than later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. As much as I dislike that man, man he's can. dead. We both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. 
smartly and right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. Come on. Lee, is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna what? turn! You're putting all of us at risk, you son Breathe. of a bitch! You're fucking worthless, Lee. You breathe. No! <laughs> what the fuck? I'm so sorry. Broke out a little just... bit of fresh air. It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Not yet. We still have to find a way out of here. I know. I know. You gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Oh, I see her ass. Like what? Yeah. Yeah, we, we, we call her to go to that. That's what it's got to call her. Some place safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. Multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Uh, rock won't help. I've got a rock. A coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm -hmm. Yeah, a rock actually could help. It's really skinny, actually, could work. I'm sorry, Billy. He was still lively. He was still alive. Jenny. for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Oh shit. He cares about keeping his family safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure. Just like Larry did. I think I may have found no, a guy here. But I need Larry, something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver or a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for him, but back at the motor end, Larry, Larry mentioned something Larry, about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your Get permission. Him for like 50 cents of baby. <laughs> do what you have to do. We're gonna search his ass around his pockets. Oh boy. <sighs> Any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Nah, no, imagine running someone's pockets and finding like a rare ass Yu-Gi-Oh card. That would be crazy. Oh, that Here we go. would be so good. The wars. And the dime. Oh, let's go. I guess the right pocket. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Damn, chill, motherfucker. <laughs> well, here's our way out, Lee. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room.
No, you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Oh yeah, the fucking view where that thing just like doing a fucking handstand. <laughs> Why the fuck is that you're doing a handstand though? I did a little class. Let me find that fucking video. Oh, oh yeah, here it is. <laughs> Soda. Oh yeah, it's really fun. I'm just going to go to my day old class.
Oh, it's very good. off our legs and try to feed them to us.
find what you're doing. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Stay back! Don't do it, Mrs. Let her go, Britta.
don't think Walker's really give a fuck. He's not rotten. Because, like, remember, even if, like, someone commits suicide, but hey, Walker start eating him. Let's say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended. But, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, and Clementine almost ate some. But? I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's tied in just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah, I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. How are you doing? I'll be fine. Just not as young as I used to be. You got fucking on, shot. Go on ahead, ahead and give tub. me and Lee a second. Why is he acting tough? You got shot, right? There's oh gonna God, be fallout. I've been streaming for two hours. Fallout? For killing Lily's dad? Yeah. I would imagine so. What do you think? Fine then. Fine. I saved Duck on the farm and didn't save Sean. Now I kill someone before I can put your little girl in danger, and I'm even more of a monster. I don't care. You do what you have to do. I'm gonna keep doing what needs to be done. The fuck Come on, down it. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? I'm gonna stay quiet. Clementine, she's smart. I'm glad she knows we're still alive. Hey, Dad. Clementine knows What's the answer. What's that noise? I don't need to tell her, right? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Figures. Oh, crap! Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. But what if it's not? Well, what if it's not fair, abandoned? If you leave your car what if it is someone? All that food in the apocalypse, like, like, like you're not asking for it. It's like you're just fucking stupid. At least lock the door, right? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. It's locked. No shit, I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Why the fuck is this option? Why don't they just unlock it? Why do I have to unlock it, right? Supplies? 
I'll take it. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Doug, why don't you carry this? Okay. More food in here. Got a box of food here. Carry it. Oh, all of a sudden, you just said it was wrong. So he looks to be much your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. It's yours now. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? <laughs> you get it from like 8 radio. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh shit. Damn, where was I actually doing work? He was moving a big ass car. This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damn word I say. Is this all you the got? To me? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what you had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. How much face is starting to add up? I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes oh, they horrible do. With their hoodies. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, alright? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Yeah, I was about to say, isn't that scene supposed to be at night? Oh, here are the choices. 56% of players left him to die. Shot Jolene. You had Danny Shooter. Helped kill Larry. Didn't kill both of the brothers. Throw food from the car. It's 50 50 at this point. Probably. I mean, it's been years for people to play the game, so people probably try to do all the ending at this point. Ugh. Well, that's enough for today. Thank you guys for joining in. This was a pretty radical stream, and uh, thank you.